So next week, this time, some of the region's premier junior athletes will be on island for the Carifta Track and Field Championships. And according to the local organizing committee, all systems are a go. Today was a significant day again for the organizers as they managed to raise an additional $12,000, which would go to purchasing tickets for primary school students to attend the three-day meet. At today's press conference, organizing committee chairperson, Braille Roberts, thanks to the community for its support once again. While seated next to officials from the Carifta regional sponsors, Lime, who rolled out their goodie bags for the meet. While on the outside, workmen put the finishing touches on the long jump runway and other preparations for the Easter weekend affair. But the chairman was elated with the support for their drive to raise funds for their primary school students to attend. All of those funds will be going towards primary school children. Uh, we're going to give them tickets, uh, each school equally. Uh, some of the pledges were for direct schools. Um, those who were pledged for direct schools will get those those tickets directly. The rest of them will be sorted equally among every every primary level school here in Cayman as well as in the Brock. So we're proud that the community is stepping up. We continue our focus on the Carifta Track and Field and Swimming Championships tonight on Let's Talk Sports at 8 on Cayman 27. Athletes and officials join us in the studio. We start with the swim team once again this evening and coach Andrea Killam Hagel. Uh, gold medalist from last year's meet and boys team captain Seiji Groom and Olympian Andrew Mackay and the rest of the swimmers as they prepare for their meet in Jamaica. And for the track and field, Olympians Ronald Forbes and Sidonia Mothersill. They'll be joining us in studio, national coach Kenrick Williams and Carifta athletes Tristan von Kirchheim and Alexander Pascal will also be here. We'll have a trivia question for you this evening in our calling segment and uh, the winner will be getting a ticket to the Carifta Track and Field Championship, so don't forget to call us this evening. Staying with track and field, as our senior national athletes prepare for Carifta, the juniors warmed up the track for them at the inter-primary meet last week and after our young hopefuls did their best for their schools, it was Red Bay Primary coming out victorious. The meet went down to the relays with Red Bay edging home. They had 328 points ahead of Johnny Cumber, who garnered 319.5 and Prospect 280. Some 15 primary schools competing in this year's meet, including a team from next door, Cayman Brack. And we end with some swimming news this evening. Cayman's ace, Sean Fraser, defends his NCAA titles this weekend. Sean hit the record books at last year's competition, winning a pair of national titles for the University of Florida. This weekend, he leads the Gators against some of the best collegiate talent in the United States. The meet was supposed to push off today at Ohio State University, but the start had to be rescheduled until tomorrow after 18 athletes from the school had to be treated for gastrointestinal illness. But Sean and his teammates were not affected and they will be in action tomorrow.